All right, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing. But now let's talk about Dogecoin. If we're looking at Dogecoin today, you guys can see it's up about 4.9%. But let's remember the entire market is up right now. But nonetheless, we'll take it because Dogecoin has been showing a lot of bullish momentum uh, for the past two to three weeks. If you've been following me on my channel on a daily basis, you guys know we kind of talk about uh, what's happening on a day to day basis. And Dogecoin has been showing bullish momentum for quite some time now. And I'm expecting, uh, you know, price movements towards the upside levels we haven't retested for months coming very soon and of course we'll get into as to why but before we do that as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so if we're looking at the price of dogecoin eight cents we're approaching the 8.1 cents mark we're up 1.9 percent in bitcoin comparative over the past 24 hours um, and also you guys can see market cap is approaching that 11.5 billion dollar mark with the 24 hour trading volume also approaching slowly but surely at that billion dollar mark which is great to see but you know we want to be discussing what's happening with the price what is next that's what everyone wants to know so let's waste no more time and get right into it so as mentioned to you guys before if you've been following me on my channel uh you know and do tune into the dogecoin updates i've mentioned to you guys that we're seeing dogecoin in an upwards trajectory and that has not been invalidated as of now as well uh, we were creating higher highs higher lows and the price is definitely in an upwards trajectory this is basic uh, technical analysis and you know when you do see uh, you know higher highs higher lows tends to be you know an upwards trend and that is what's uh, pretty much been looking like for dogecoin since literally this breakout that we saw um, obviously when this entire market uh, saw this huge move towards the upside but look where we're finding ourselves again guys you know you can't make this up so we're gonna be looking at some shorter uh, zoomed in prices to give you guys a better understanding as to where we're exactly sitting and the significance of the levels we're sitting at right now so let's draw a trend line okay and um, once we're able to draw this trend line I think you guys will be able to understand way better as to what exactly is going on for doge and why this is so so important so let's extend this and uh, there we are okay so you guys can see we're facing a huge huge resistance coming up in our way and now if you want to know what the resistance price is that is at 8.44 cents you guys can see that was uh you know a wick that we did go above this resistance just a few days back but of course that did not hold we did see the entire market see a little bit of a pullback and obviously dogecoin did make its way back down so i would consider this as a rejection but speaking about rejections we've seen several rejections after uh um, you know this massive move back in october of last year we've seen countless of times the price of breaking out of this resistance over and over again but every single time we've seen a cancel um you know resistance it's always made its way back down and of course you guys can come out and say it's due to the overall market and that's true it's because you know times when you know we were seeing dogecoin popping out of this resistance you guys can see we even made it up to 11 cents we made it up to um a 10 cents we made it up to in april when dogecoin logo was added onto twitter uh, in april we made it to 10.5 cents and other than that never um, saw the price go back above so last time the price broke out of this resistance guys was literally back in april and that was obviously due to Elon Musk tweeting about um, Twitter. I'm sorry, Dogecoin and uh, Dogecoin logo being added on a Twitter platform, which is huge. So that was the reason as to why we saw this breakout. And you know, this is the first time in months, pretty much in April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November. So seven months later, we finally you know retested this resistance and we actually broke out of here and now what it's looking like this next green candle will be uh, i think the big charm where we see the price actually kicking out of here and actually closing above here we need to turn this level into support so you know how it's uh, being a resistance right now we're seeing rejection after rejection we need to uh, break out and close that uh, into a support and then if that's able to be uh, done then you know i think we're about to see a new yearly high coming up very very soon speaking about a new yearly high guys let's put this into perspective that's only a move of about 35 percent roughly from the current price levels and i think that is more likely than ever especially if bitcoin uh, pushes up to 40k bitcoin 
Bitcoin is also creating higher highs, higher lows. You know, Bitcoin wants to push towards the upside. It's no secret at this point. Uh, we've seen manipulation occurring in Bitcoin's price uh, severely over the past uh, few weeks. Pretty much th throughout the month of November, we've seen tremendous amount of liquidations happening for both shorts and longs. You can see this for yourself. Um, but I think Bitcoin is ready to make its way up towards the upside. So do you have very, very close eyes on BTC? But I'm very, very optimistic that Dogecoin breakout is very near. Let me know down below what you guys think. And also let me know if you guys like these updates. Is it easy for you to understand? And of course, if you want to see more updates, love you all. See you tomorrow. Been Crypto ZX and peace out.